Let's let's break this down. Let's first start with the the handshake yeah. issue, the political part of this with Governor Perry. What do you think about what he said? I actually don't have a complete problem with his statement. Well, I don't either. When you first, when you first at first blush, when you hear that a governor is not going to meet to shake hands on the tarmac, your immediate reaction is a negative one. But you dig deeper into it, and it actually looks like. It's the president that just wants the photo op. He just wants the quick and easy handshake when he has Democrats in his own party saying there is, in fact, a humanitarian crisis on the border and talking about Katrina moments. Then at that point, it looks like Rick Perry does have the upper hand when he's say, saying basically the same thing Democratic Senate uh, congressman from the state saying, which is this requires more than a photo op. This requires more than a handshake. This requires more than you looking out from 30,000 feet from your plane. Of course, the optics of it, Mark Halpern, also not great for the president of the United States because he is going down there and holding two fundraisers, but not visiting uh, the scene of a humanitarian crisis. Um, but the president. Is taking a tough tone, Mark. It's uh, once again he's finding himself caught in between two factions: the left and the right. Uh, the left wanting him to do much more; the right saying he's just not doing enough. I think his schedule will change in some way. I, I bet on that. Look, the, you know, Katrina was a shared responsibility of the federal government, state, and local government. This is really a federal issue, uh, and it's a it's a humanitarian crisis involving kids. And I think governance matters here. And and the president needs to rise above the politics, the back and forth with Rick Perry, fo any talk of photo ops. Really, just needs to get hands on, I think, and solve it. And if he's in the state and isn't being hands on, not just the optics are bad, but he's not he's not doing the job. We we hired him to do, part of which is manage a crisis like this that, again, is not uniquely a federal responsibility, but mostly is his job.